All right, welcome back to Starcrawlers. We are, we, well, we just finished a simple mission and we got an email from PAR Entertainment. And they said, your positive actions regarding certain sensitive materials have not gone unnoticed. You, we will be watching. So we made friends with them just a little bit. That means they're more likely to give us uh, contracts in the future. Now, let's see. Samus has one ability point to spend. What's it going to be? Hmm. I'm not sure I was crazy about this tree last time I took it. And custom armor ain't bad. We're going to take crack shot. It's not that bad. Right? Yeah. It's not that bad. I wouldn't mind taking demolition, but... Yeah. Let's go for it. Okay. Next, what do you have for sale? Um, what she? Okay, let's take a look at what our guys are equipped with. Okay, catch you later. Inventory. You have that's level three. That's level one. Okay, that's level three. That's irrelevant. So let's take a look at our heavy armor for her. Uh, that's level 2 armor. That's level 2 uh, tactical armor. And that is level 2 tactical armor. Alright. So, we have... Uh, what is this again? Heavy armor. Okay, well let's change over to Samus. Okay, so this one's just all around better. A little bit. Okay. Bio booster 2, reinforced 4. I don't know, but this one will be easier to, or cheaper to upgrade. So let's take it. Okay. Alright. Let's go back. Use the upgrade station. Damage blocked, increased by 10%. Okay, so let's purchase Reinforced 4 for 102. Alright, and then... Let's see. Catch you later. I'm sorry, let's go ahead and get that equipped or I'm just going to get confused. So, here we go. Back. What do we have for sale? Just sell that. Oops. Yeah, sell that. Thank you. Alright. I think we're gonna be fine. Catch you later. What do you have for sale? No med kits? No? Alright then. Goodbye. Now. Hmm. Check the job board for work. I think it's time for us to go ahead and do the story mission. I accept. Mm -hmm. Here we are. Welcome to the picturesque Stella Marin, I guess. This is Deck 110. According to directions from Aurora, you want to head over to the commercial plaza and then an elevator ride down to 105 for the nearest nav chamber and black box. Easy as pie. Sounds simple enough. Got two calls waiting for you from Horizon Robotics and Workers United. For a hush-hush mission, there's a lot of people up in our business. Typical. Likely every two-bit snitch on the take's been bartering intel since the second we found that ship. What do they want? Both are proposing a quick job while you're already bored. Decent pay offer. Uh, so who do you want to talk to first? Uh, not sure. I got any details about the employers. Horizon Robotics is one of the UFP fact cats rich as Crassus too. Workers United is a civ group protecting the rights of greasers and such. What do you want to talk to you first? Let's just talk to Horizon. Right, stand by for transmission for Horizon Robotics. The hollow display darkens momentarily, then flickers back on, revealing a flash-looking corp mouthpiece with an oily grin. 
you can almost taste the insincere winks about to be directed your way. Hey there, partner. My employer has a little favor to ask. Aurora is determined to get their hands on that black box, but the intel really ought to go to Horizon first. As the unofficial UFP leader, we have a responsibility to make sure all evidence is handled properly. Sounds like something you should take up with Aurora. Well now, sometimes it's easier to come at these things sideways rather than start a confrontation. All we need is a copy of the data just to make sure it's not tampered with. You can still take back the box to Aurora afterwards, and they'll be none the wiser. Aurora said transmitting the data might cause corruption. Sounds like a scare tactic to me. Those boxes are made to withstand just about anything. Send that data our way, you'll be 300 credits richer, and no one will need to know except the two of us. Okay, so we got a hacker option here. Forcing a burst data transmit could cause corruption, meaning we might not get uh, get paid by Aurora. You'll have to do better than 300. Hmm. Horizon doesn't negotiate with the labor pool. You want to keep working, you'll take what's offered. Think on that a bit while you're wandering around. I'm sure you'll make the right decision. The transmission cuts out abruptly as the rep disconnects the call. What do workers ride want? I have pros for you. I need the black box data you can hire to obtain. We want the raw data, not whatever's left after Corp PR finishes their hatchet job. Forward us a copy before handing it over, and we'll consider your debt paid. My debt? Why, yes, your debt. Your team stole medical supplies that were legally paid for by the Bright Hall Colony, and you delivered them to Chimera. Were you aware that Chimera then resold them to the colony at five times the original price? Disgusting. I didn't steal any medical supplies for Chimera. The clipped tone of the Workers United rep takes on an air of menace. Do not insult my intelligence and waste our time by playing dumb. You acted as a pawn for Chimera whether you were aware of the impact of your actions or not. Fortunately for you, this is an opportunity to make some form of amends. How do you know about this? We have eyes everywhere. The common worker is oppressed by the corporate machines. You do well to remember that when considering who to steal from in the future. But I digress. Will you transmit the black box data? to us and clear your debt, think carefully before you respond. It's not going to happen. I'm under contract with another party. A deal's a deal. Keep in mind that you'd be doing a great service to the families of the missing colonists. Don't you think they deserve to know the truth? Maybe, but it's not my responsibility to give it to them. I'm sorry to hear that. The offer still stands if you change your mind. With no further conversation, the rep cuts off the call. Alright. Seems like your services are in demand today. Here's hoping that works out to my advantage. Let's stay on mission and worry about the pay later. Okay, let's go find the black box and get paid. Um... Okay. Now I get... Close my curtains because the ship is dark. I can't see anything. Hmm. This way first, I guess. Hmm. Alright, well, there's a security cache. How about that? Boom slaying lobber. Let's just take it all. That was easy peasy. Now, uncommon heavy weapon. Well, I think Bender uses heavy weapons. A Shiyama Lobber. <laughs> Death Mountain. That's nice. Alright. Hmm. You know, they're kind of equivalent, aren't they? Uncommon SMG. Uncommon heavy armor. Yeah. None of them are very interesting, are they? What are you using? An SMG? Well, that SMG ought to be better. Or is it? Hmm. It's kind of junk, isn't it? Heavy armor. Yeah. Looks like junk to me. Now, while we're at this, sorry, I want us to go ahead and use our drugs. So, Justin is squishy. So, I kind of want to give that to him. Let's see how it goes. Now, Bender is going to be... Um, kind of tanking it a little bit, so I'm going to give that to him. Oh, Bender cannot eat. <laughs> Alright. 
Alright then. That settles it. Justin gets it. And... I'm gonna give it to Samus. Well, nope, that was the only one we had. Alright. Yep. Yeah, good enough for now. Any weirdness over here? Okay. finding stuff in the flower beds last time I played it, but that was during like the holiday sale special and there was all kinds of random stuff being thrown into the game. You merge into the wide inviting halls of a posh residential area. The upper decks clearly housed the affluent passengers. A waiter bot is idling nearby and turns as you enter, waving an oddly cheery, cheering greeting. Domestic helper, inferior programming, yet it may know things. Ah, excellent. Here come the concierge with drinks. Make mine a double. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're being attacked by a waiter. Okay, well, he hit our shields, but no damage. That's good. There we go. And... Demean him. And... Let's go ahead and... Alright, 210, 206. That's what I don't like about the crack shot, is it takes so long, you know? Whatever. I think we can just blow this guy up. Yeah. I'm almost tempted to go for this risk. But let's not. Let's just do that. Oh, good, it missed. Gimbo. Shoot him. And... Blow him up. And... Shoot him. There we go. Click to continue. Your team stares in stunned silence at the downed bot. Did we use the wrong fork or something? What got into that thing? Not an aggressor. Behavior does not compute. Data corruption? Call Luna and report the attack. You sure love chatting with me, don't you? What's up? We just got attacked by a common domestic bot. That was definitely not in the job specs. This job was supposed to be milk toast fetch quest, so not now we're brawling with domestics. Think it think this merits extra hazard pay? I'll ping Doc to get on the wire to Aurora. I wouldn't mind if they tossed a little extra hazard pay our way. Is it pretty hazardous there behind your hollow display? Depends on your definition of a hazard. Your impending demise is my impending unemployment. Just looking out for what's best for the team. Okay, we'll watch for more hostiles. Alright, what's going on? Look at this. Ah, uh, it's nothing. It does react to your mouse click, or does it? Maybe not. It's like, it looked like it did, but anyway. Oh, there's a cred stick. Or not. There's one over here, though. After that... Doors are quiet. Ooh. The figure emerges clumsily from behind a bulkhead, waving his hands to get your attention. Logos on his suit indicate he works for the double... Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, Dablue... Dablue Yutaki Corporation. Dablue Yutaki employee. Don't shoot. I'm not armed. I'm glad you're not one of those psychotic waiter bots. You're crawling a hulk unarmed? Is this amateur hour? Even I pack a weapon. That blue AU Katani employee. Ah, right. Listen, I'm in a real bind, and you look capable. Maybe you could help me out? There's easy credits in it for you. Hold up. Stella Marin is supposed to be on lockdown. What are you doing here? Well, respectfully, what are you doing here? I think we both know that the corpse all play by their own rules. I'm just trying to capitalize on their interests, same as you. Plus, when WA... 
Taki says jump, you don't ask why. So about those credits. Right. W.A. Yutaki sent me he in here to locate a former employee's residence. They have intel that he was recruiting for Workers United and they want to get their hands on a copy of his recruitment records. I was, also, uh, I was expecting an empty ship, but I've been running from domestics since I walked in. I'm not geared for this, but if you can locate the records and wire me a copy, I'll pay 50 credits for each file you send. Okay. Uh, I'm familiar with W.A. Yutaki's response to failures within their organization. Perhaps you should reconsider the amount you're offering, or I'm betting those files will be heavily encrypted. 50 credits barely covers my consulting fee. Let's go with Justin. Yeah, damn. Okay, I'm not risking getting D.Y. pissed. Here's my comm link address. Wire me any U Workers United files you find, and I'll pay 100 credits per file. Either way, I'm out of this hellhole right now. Nice doing business with you. Alright, so, got a mini quest. Is there a light switch? <laughs> I would like... Oh, Sorry. Sorry! I know that sounds so dumb, but I still just... I still get startled. There we go, there's some lights. <laughs> and suddenly the windows seem change. Alright. Crack shot, why not? Shoot it. Lock it. Alright. Gonna stun it. Shoot it. Hmm. Did a little bit of damage there. Uh oh. Well, at least he shot it. Shoot again? Okay. <laughs> Click to continue. Alright. Um, yeah, I did want that on. So I can see a little bit better. Okay. Nope. Hmm. Mangled something. Whatever. Take it. Hmm. Okay. Let's go in the bathroom. Uh, is there a light switch? I want a light switch. Oh, there's a cred stick blowing in the dark. Oh, there's a cabinet. And a med kit. Okay. There's a toilet with a cred stick in it. Groovy. Alright, let's just get out of here. That was... Hmm. Let's check out the perimeter here. Alright. Well, there's another bad guy in here. So, don't be startled. Anything in there? No. Alright. Toss a trap this time, see how that goes. Now, overheat. What's your bonus? Adaptive armor, okay. Yeah, sure, knock it. Now. Yeah, let's do the bounce on Betty. Space Turkey Foot. Hmm. The infamous Grouse. Bruce. Something. Ah, oh, risque photos. Okay. Well. Hmm. Could we turn the light on? Alright, at least there's a little bit of light in here. Looks like the toilet will open. There's nothing in it. Dead stick. 
cabinet has credits. Alright. Well, that was not particularly... Wait, what? Was there a... I think I was seeing things. Alright. Well, that's two rooms down. Let's just go and see what's behind. Oh, there's a robot. Well, okay, robot. Oh, he's got friends. Okay. Now we gotta think a little bit. Alright, a helper bot and a helper bot. Hmm. Well, let's, uh, overheat the helper bot. Pop out a trap. Okay, it missed. I'll take that. Let's, uh, there we go. Now, let's go ahead and do bounce and buddy. Hmm. Yeah, he's stunned. Always nice to see. What are you gonna Okay, so let's go ahead and stun this one then. As much as I can if I can stun lock. See now he's confused. I don't know how to get that way. I still gotta figure out what I'm doing to make him confused. Okay. Next. Let's go ahead and well who's got the most hit points? Alright, why melt that one? for a frag grenade. There you go. Ooh, ow. Alright. Hmm. Can we just kill this thing? Let's try. Ah. Oh! Ow. That had to hurt. Alright, Akimba will take care of the other one, so let's just do that one. Looking for the black box on the Stella Marin. Not sure how much longer this uh, quest is going to take, but we're going to end this episode for now. And when you come back, uh, we will resume. Thanks for watching.